catch this thing. Would that be cool? I think you guys ought to figure out a way how we're going to get this thing. Because if we catch this thing, I mean, this is going to be history or this is going to be... Big bucks. You know, just, th just think about it. They've been looking for Bigfoot or Some whatever killer. it is. Big bucks for it. It might. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but if you bring it in alive, think of the money that you get from that sucker. Yeah, but how are we going to catch it? Freak show. Well, no, you could set up a trap. I mean... A big hole. Sticks. Big a hole. We don't want to kill it though. If we kill like it, news, then, yeah. I'm just know? talking about maiming it. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. Well, I don't care if we maim it, but uh, that way it doesn't run as fast. Yeah, there's plenty of it. So maybe we can just chase it down. We put net, it down. nets up in like a big square, like bunch of trees. Run him into it, and then like we all like. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Well, it can't. It can't be very far. I mean, the thing must live around here. It was down there. Yeah, it was right near the trail camera down there. Yeah, yeah, so if it's if it's living right here somewhere, we ought to be able to come up with something because it can't be too far. Down by the trail camera, it's just been eating corn. Yeah, yeah. I right. bet. It's been eating the corn too. Yeah. Huh. Sweet. <laughs> you just leave like a bread, like a corn trail. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Corn trail. Now, seriously, this thing, this thing could be dangerous. I mean, we could actually be getting hurt here if we go after this thing. So I'm not I'm not from blind horse standpoint here I'm not telling you guys you've got to do this if you if you guys are too afraid to do this and we're not going to do it oh, we're not afraid. too afraid no. <laughs> I'm not scared we got right, well, your bear spray well, right whatever it is it needs to be got you know what I mean like we, we need to get it yeah. Well, I heard, you know, they did that Monster Quest thing on TV, and they were talking about some creature out there at Salt Fork, and I think Zen, what did yeah, you say? Yeah, the grass man. Yeah, you know, the grass man or something. They did a, a whole thing on it, so this could be it. I mean, well, it's in, I mean that's just right down the road, so right. Salt Fork's just right down yeah. the road. Yeah. I mean, if it is something like that, you know how far it can drive. Yeah. Okay. All right, well, let's, uh, let's go get some stuff and see what we can do. Yeah, let's catch this thing. Let's go. Alright, he went in the woods, like, right over there. Yeah, it was somewhere, because he come out over here. Yeah, there's a little open. That, uh, branch above it. No, a little bit over farther. But let's, uh, yeah. Our way let's down. surround him, and then, and then you got the... Yeah, I got the lasso. Maybe we can get him... You guys get him going towards me, maybe I can get a rope around him. Alright. Now be careful, we don't, we, don't we don't know what this thing is, we don't know what it's going to do. Like sneak up on him? Yeah, you don't want to follow him. Well, we just got to see where it was at first. And see if we can... Yeah, it was right down here by the corn piles where it come out. We could be trying to, you know, tackle a freaking bear. <laughs> no, we should be quiet. Boys, stay with me. Ouch. Careful. That's where it went. Okay. Boys, stay right here. I mean it. Right here. Don't move. If you see or hear anything that scares you, just run. Split up. I'll go to the left this way if you guys want to.
I'm up. Be careful, be careful. Stop kicking. I see it. Oh my gosh, don't hurt him. And construction on Interstate 70 has reduced traffic to one lane near the I-70-77 interchange. A little debris on the highway. Motorists are encouraged to plan ahead and, and, and use alternate routes to avoid delays. Uh, apparently, unconfirmed reports to our newsroom are claiming that a Bigfoot-type creature has been spotted, possibly captured in the northern end of the county. Early reports say that the man-like creature was spotted hiding in the woods near 8th Street Road, and despite the reports, uh, the actual whereabouts of this prehistoric man-like being are unknown at this time. Weather-wise, it's going to be a sunny one today, and we're looking for a high in mid-80s. Right now at the airport, it's 79 degrees.